Okay, here to do a First Amendment audit at the Nevada Department of Corrections Administrative Facility again over in 5500 Snyder in Carson City. Came back today after yesterday's incident where uh, Deputy Director Bill Quenga assaulted me, um, filing a criminal complaint against him for that and doing a, another uh, public records request to find out everything we can and to make sure that we're doing the right thing. So that's what's up. And I'm gonna go inside, walk around the buildings, do, do, do an audit on them. So here we go. Same signs that were up yesterday. Nothing prohibiting me from coming in there. Must stop at reception station. Hi again, how are you? How can I help you? Is uh, Director Daniels available? No, he's not available today. Okay, I've got uh, something to drop off for him. I've got a, I'd like to uh, talk to somebody from, in, from Internal Affairs. Got an Internal Affairs criminal complaint. Okay. And uh, then I've also got another information request form to uh, drop off today. Sure, uh, did you get our form online to fill out? No, I print my own. Wait, well, it has to be no, it doesn't. No, NRS 239. Um, uh, you, you, you've got to make reasonable accommodations for people with disabilities, and so I'm going to request a reasonable accommodation if that's that's your point. Um, so I've got issues with my hands and writing, so you can understand why I don't want to handwrite your form, right? And I don't have to disclose my medical issues with you. Um, I'm just telling you that under the Americans with Disabilities Act, I like a reasonable accommodation for you to accept my form. Okay. Uh, you know, yep. Can you get somebody from Internal Affairs? Because I, I can sit here all day long if, if that helps. I'll call them and so, you let, let them know I'd like to file a complaint. If they would just come and deal with me professionally, I'm a very professional human being. I, I, I'd never threaten anybody. I, I'm, I'm willing to speak in a very calm manner. And uh, I just want to do my business with the government and move on. So if you could have them come down and take my complaint, I would be grateful. See, you, sir, sir you're, you're a young man. I appreciate your attitude. Thank you. Doing my job. And, and that's all that I want is people to do their job and take care of business and be polite. Or you, you can help me take a complaint? They're all afraid of, see the young guy is not afraid of the camera, but all the other people are, why are they afraid of me? No, 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 you, you saw how that, that deputy director rushed me. You ever read the definition of assault under the Nevada revised statutes? I'm very aware that he, he met the definition of assault under the statute with what he did. So why is a deputy director so afraid of a man with a camera, but a young man like you with little life experience learning stuff is fearless? So, so I'm, I'm just, I'm giving you props, man, is what I'm doing. Thank you, I appreciate that. So um, we have resources on our website for filing a digital IA complaint. Well, I appreciate that, but what if people don't have access to computers? You know, some people can't, we don't need ID to vote, right? And we're supposed to make our society as functional as possible, whether you have a computer access or not computer access, right? So doesn't that seem rather discriminatory when I'm here in person at the agency where I can file the complaint where the people well, actually work? Well, I understand that, but you said typing will be preferable to you, and that's the instruction that you Right, well, I, I type at my home, and then I come down to make sure I do it in person, because the problem with government, the reason I'm with my camera, is government is unaccountable. So, so young man, you, you've got more rights in life than I do. Do you know how you have more rights than I do? I'm not a peace officer. No, 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 you're, you're a government employee. So as a government employee, you're covered by what's called a, a qualified immunity, whether, whether you're a peace officer or a secretary for the governor's office or, or whatever your nature in government is. Uh, the, the Supreme Court's granted government employees qualified immunity. There's two so, tiers of people in our well, society. I respect and appreciate your concern, so I'm giving you a valid uh, solution to your issue. Oh, if you, if you can accept my complaint, I'm just interacting because you, you were interacting and I'm appreciating what you're doing. I, I do. What I'd like is, here, this is a complaint 
I'd like a copy of it dated, showing received, so I've, I've, I've got it stamped in saying... Right, you have to receive it though, and what I want is a copy that you've received it. Right, so I want I want you to stamp it copied, received, and give me a copy back. So I've got a copy, you've got a copy. You're not going to accept that because that's not our form. If you go to the Inspector General section on our website. Well, well, uh, again, you're not going to accept it. I'm I'm telling you, I'm filing the complaint. Let, let me put it to you this way: Would you guys rather investigate it internally? Because I've also already contacted Director Tagliati of DPS. I'm, I'm contacting the FBI. I'm contacting multiple agencies. I've already filed a complaint with the, the sheriff's office. They accepted my complaint in their form. Would you like to accept my complaint that's written, clearly legible, and not discriminate against me? Or are you going to discriminate against me because I have a camera or a blue shirt or because of the color of my skin? Why are you discriminating against me? So. I, I'm going to let you help me. I'm giving you a report here to take. See? Okay, then I'll just stand right here. And I've got, I want to file an NRS 239 information request under the law. So there we go. We'll just, we'll just put our cameras right here. Do we got some people coming through the door here? How can we help, sir? Hi there. What was your name again? Bill. Bill, you're, you're, you're the guy that assaulted me yesterday. Um, I'm here to file a complaint and another information request. All that I simply want is a time and date stamp saying that you guys received it, and I will leave. You simple what file I want. A complaint on our website? Uh, I, I'm, I want to file a complaint in person. It's on uh, our website. I, I don't want to use the website. I want a written paper complaint. Everything's wanna... filed through the website, sir. That's all I can tell you. Uh, uh, well, so so, the, so if I don't have access to internet, you're discriminating against me. So if you don't have access to internet, you can't file a complaint. Is that what you're saying? Is that yeah. the policy of the Nevada Department of Corrections? So, you so have a camera, you have internet, you know, you said you have internet. It doesn't matter what I have or don't have. I'm just asking you. Would you like for us to provide you a phone? You, you have discriminatory practices Would in place. Would you like us to? Uh, uh, no, I want, I want to file the complaint that I've typed out okay. that is clearly legible. Mm -hmm. And see what I don't get, you guys is you know that I, I, I could become litigious, and I don't want to become litigious. If you watched my videos, you'll, you'll notice what I always say, is I'd much rather educate than litigate. Okay, so, so I want you to take my complaint, mm -hmm. take my information request, and follow the law. That's all that I'm, I'm not asking. A, do we have a phone number and an email address we can contact? There, 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 there's an email address on there and a phone number and my name on the complaint. Okay. I tried to email the complaint to you, sir. Yes, and I tried to email the complaint to the director, mm -hmm. but guess what? You guys have shut down your, your email system. I don't know why. Oh, uh, it's, it's right here. If you'd like to look at it, you're, yeah. you'll see yeah. where, where the email got shot down. No, I haven't received your, I don't know why your complaint will come through because I got some threatening emails from viewers. Oh, no, they're, they're, they're just people out watching. Okay. I don't I'm control not, them. I'm just saying, so I received those, so I don't see why yours would be. So in that Well, case, no, I, I, I was trying to email my complaint in last night, and unfortunately you blocked me, so I couldn't Can you fill that. out the public records request well, as well, our my, policy? My hands hurt is the problem, and so that's why I only like to type once, because my hands, so really what I'm asking for is an, a reasonable accommodation under the Americans with Disabilities Act, that you accept my complaint that I've already typed out, and I've already hurt my hands, so I don't have to continue hurting my hands. And under, you know, under the Americans with Disabilities, yeah, I don't even have to give you the, my no, reasoning. No, no, I'm just you asking for a reasonable right, accommodation. So you got your complaint there, so which complaint is, is this? The so there's, PR? There, there's two, two pieces of paper there. There's, whoops, sorry guys. There's two pieces of paper there, guys. Uh, one is the complaint, mm -hmm. and one is the information request. I will take your complaint, and I'll, this is the complaint? There's two pieces the, the, of the, the, the email is the complaint, so, and, and that's got the phone you. number. And what's, what's your name, sir? My name's uh, Investigator Scudia. And your uh, number? Employee number, badge number? Uh, 3551. 3551. So where's your public records request? These are both complaints. Oh, oh. This is not a public records request. Uh, no, there's, he's got the public records request right there. It says NRS 239 at the top. Okay, so this is your email. It's const, C-O-N-S-T, number two, audit at gmail.com. Yes. Okay. And like I said, sir, we will send you, let, per policy, we will send you an email with a letter from the department saying we've acknowledged your public records request. Thank you. 
So you're saying you have an ADA disability, so we'll send this to you. Yeah, I just don't my hands hurt. Like, yeah, we, we'd like, the reason why our policy says that is because we like people to fill out all the news media, I deal with them, they fill it out to the public records request because it is a court document and we have to, we keep a record so that if you say, hey, I filed something, so if I get this and this gets lost or something, there's a record of receipt is what we do. Right. Not so that it's, it's, it's exactly. taken care of forwardly right. so that it's not dropped in, in I appreciate the process. That. That's what we don't want. Okay. So in, in our in our agency, we always like to have the documentation so that if you drop something off here and it doesn't get to me or whoever's supposed to get to, there's no record of it. Right. That's what we don't want. Okay. And it's happened in the past. And we just don't want that. Okay. We want to make sure that we're responding to any request that comes out. Okay. And, and, and the other thing that I'd like to offer, like I said, I'm, I'm a very calm person. Mm -hmm. Uh, my goal in taking filming and reporting it and disseminating it to the public, uh, beyond exercising my, my freedom of press, our freedom of press rights, is my, my plan has been all along to go to the legislature. I've been a lobbyist in the past. I'm going to register again as a lobbyist again this year. And I'm taking these videos to the legislature. So, so what I would like from my government, you my government employees, I would like to be able to sit down and talk to you and find out what are your issues, why do you treat people so horribly the way you've treated me, what can we do to overcome it, how can we fix some of the problems in government and make it better for all of the people. So I don't think I've got an unreasonable view of things. And can I don't, you email me everything that you were saying? I, I can't, I, 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 I tried to, That's, if you look at part of my complaint it says I'd like to sit down with you. Okay, but even, I, I want to hear everything that you, you were just addressing. It's well, it's, I'm also, yeah, it, can, it'll also be posted online so you can that's, watch that's it. Why, yeah, um, but if, but, like I said again, record, I, if you can email it to me, try to email. If it doesn't email, I gave you my card. You, you did, and that's, yeah. that's where I got the, that, I got that's the where, email. Like I said, your, your email bounced back to me, and the director's email bounced back to me. Do you, do you have a copy of the complaint there, sir? I do. Sir, uh, did you look at the bottom I, of the complaint? Sir, I have to say that, yes, I did see this email come through. Oh, did you see it? Yeah. Because so if, I don't know why back so to flip, you. flip it over on the other side of it there. And you see the big red light there? See, I got a message saying last night that it all bounced oh. back. Okay. So yours, I, I, yours. You know why? Because you're an outside. So sometimes outside, we've changed our email system going out. So we're, we're we just went over to the Office 365 probably a couple months ago. Yes. So we're having issues. We got this system in there that if it doesn't know, because we sometimes we we'll get spammed. We got to eliminate and not get spammed. So it's blocking, and we have to go in and open it up and say, hey. Yeah. Is it? Do you want acceptance? But, I haven't but seen that. I got I got the red Last light. Week. That's that's why I came oh. in today. I wasn't coming here just to do. I, you guys yeah. gave me the red light. I mean, that's. Well, we'll, we'll take a look at. It. I'll find out why. But now that I know what your address is, I could unblock it and okay. allow not unblock it, but to allow it to come in because we do block certain content. We get uh, certain material out there that's trying to you know get information that we're not entitled or just some spoof company out there or something okay. we have to be careful being in this agency because we do protect the records so we have to protect the information of our staff our department and our population and, and that part i that's, that part that's i very i appreciate that part if, again if you watch the videos that i've done in the, the couple of weeks i've been doing these audits you'll find one of my big things mm -hmm. especially dmv director julie butler she needs to go Chief J.D. Decker, they, they really should have never come and seized my papers from my business and I, got me off uh, my butt. I can't comment. I, I know, I don't want you to comment. I'm putting it on the record part. because I'm, yeah. I, I am also being very okay. political in, in what I'm doing. Our, our department, whatever issue you have, we will talk with the executive team and then we can go from there. So um, again, I'd like to sit down and talk. That's my open okay. invitation. I, I don't want to be the work. I don't want to be a jerk. I just want to exercise my rights mm -hmm. i don't want illegal no, directives and and i didn't appreciate the way that you assaulted me i don't think i, I don't want you to i'm just telling you you rushed I and i had to try to give you the here to discuss, discuss, discuss I, i'm just so, okay, so you've got, you got your your information we will e i will email you um and we'll go from there okay i appreciate right. you coming out and taking and, it and I, and I really appreciate your demeanor today and because yesterday i really felt you were very how would you? Apprehensive of all that oh, stuff. Oh, I'm very, I'm still very I tried apprehensive. To do that, so. But yeah. that, you know, that was yesterday. Wait, you're not going to turn it off. I'm going to walk. You're not going to accept my, my, uh,
What could you request? I, I, oh, what? You need? Why are you moving up on me so fast? Public. Sir, could you please yeah. maintain your distance? Sir, please maintain your distance. I'm giving you information. Okay. Um, can you I, could, could I give you some information? No, I don't need I've, information. I've, what, what is your question? Well, I've, I've got my information request here. Okay, right. but here's a formal. We don't answer. You have to put in a formal request. Uh, uh, no, I can use my own form. No, sir. It's clearly this is stated. Here's the public information form. Please. Put, sir, what was your name? Sir, could you please identify? I believe, I believe your policy says you need to identify. You, I'm you, trying to, to. We'll handle this matter. You, you need to remember, I was illegally arrested, hmm. and I don't know. That and, wasn't there. And and, and, and okay. I was hotboxed. Okay. So you guys have a nice day. So eighth, eighth Amendment violation is what you guys did on there. Well, you did. Your warden did. I will. I appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, guys. I guess we got a little reaction. Finally, I didn't get a receipt, but I know who he is. That's the guy that assaulted me. Got them taking the complaint, doing their thing. But good God, why is it so hard to do this? So again back to why I'm doing this. I'm a human being with a little bit of time that I can spend to do this, but if you're a human being that's been arrested, they take a bunch of your money to get out of jail, then you gotta get a lawyer, and you gotta figure out the system, and you gotta go to work the next day, and go to work for 10 or 12 hours a day to keep your job, to keep feeding yourself, to, to pay your rent. Our, our system is messed up for people. H how can people get ahead anymore? How can they make a good life for themselves when they've got the government just at them and everything the government does is designed to make their life harder and to take more of their money or their life or their freedom just because they can for some odd reason. It's just a frustrating system and that's what I want to try to change and fix. So uh, I'm going to be signing off.